actually help them to train to fight back for their own home. So that way they can get the hell out of here and you don't have to deal with them. Now, is that a good way to look at it? No. But is it a way to look at it? Hell yeah. Um, it's definitely one way to look at it and it's not... Again, it's not the best way, but... If you're going to look at it any other way, you got to look at it from that point of view as well. Like, you got all these refugees running around doing their own little thing, and you can definitely help them. You, the pay might not be the best, but at least you can have them help you defend your borders so that way they can continue to stay safe and help other people in their life. I don't know. Maybe it's me overlooking things and being like, oh, yes. Sweet. We gotta go back to the Waking Sands. Why do I have to go all the way back there? Oh, right. Ah, yes. To learn about how materia works. Oh, and how to stick it in my weapons. And do all that stuff. <sighs> Apologies. I need to stretch there. Welcome back, I'm pleased. Yada yada yada, shut up. Give me my XP. I am now questioning whether or not this XP boost helps with, um... The, uh, what's it called? Ah, I don't remember. Um, I don't, I, I don't think the XP boost actually does help me gain more XP through the quests. Uh, or through the, yeah. Through, through my secondary objectives, through my missions, through all that. I don't think I get that 3% boost whenever I complete objectives. Which kind of sucks, but whatever. I, I have no real reason to complain because again, uh, within an hour, we went up three fucking levels. I'm not opposed to that. We're also now at level 28, so, again, I cannot complain about anything. Um, we're in a good spot for getting to level 90 super quick. Now, if only I can beat the game twice as fast. Um, it'll definitely help out when I get my own mount, because then I don't have to run around everywhere, but... Now it's just like, um, it's a pain in the ass. Here, take this. Put, put materia in them. Why can I not skip this? There we go. I was about to say, come on, man! Let me skip it. I don't want to look at this. And it's the eighth the right ticket again.
carry enhanced daggers. Here you go, have them. Lord of the Inferno, here we go. We got our first trial. We are about to go and complete nine bronze, six silver. What does she want for these? 500 each. It's a hefty chunk of change, actually. Damn. Okay. So I'm going to waste two minutes of our time uh, going to Steps of Nald. I'm going to TP back here. Ports of the Flame Sergeant at Camp Drybone. We will in two minutes. I want to go uh, use up a couple more glamours on my sword and board. Or my sword and shield, as it were. We're going to Aethernet over to the Adventurer's Guild. Uh, and while we're doing that, I'm going to go plug in my phone so I don't have to worry about it being dead later. There we go. Okay. So, now that we've done that... We're going to uh, partake in an inn of her uh, room. Tire to an inn room, yes. The hourglass. We want main hand, off hand. Carnage, sword, yes. And the iron lantern shield, there we go, yes. Hit a glamour plates, sword, board, save, yes, apply. Huzzah! There we go. Nicely done. Okay. Time to whisk ourselves away from here. <laughs> See, told you, two minutes. Not even. Like a minute and a half. Fastest glamour pit stop you'll ever see. <laughs> Minute and a half. Uh, we're gonna go sell some gear real quick. Why and wait in the Invisible City? Yes. Merchant and Mender, purchase weapons. Sell, sell. Bam. Here, you can have this Dispeller too. I don't want it. And that's all. Thank you for your uh, patronage. I shall be off. We're going to release our Iron Will so I can run past everything, hopefully, maybe. As long as I'm given a decent enough path. Because um, if I don't have to get into a fight right away, I will be so happy about that. Uh, we have all of our recommended gear on. What the fuck is that? I don't know what that is, but I want nothing to do with it. That's about all I do know. Lie in waits. Waiting. Level 24. Oh, baby. It's a good thing we're four levels over. Oh.
Okay, Ungust. Let's get this over with. I'm just going to deal with everything that I know I can kill, because nobody else will for the time being. Um, they're all too busy dealing with the, the leader. So I'm like, I'll deal with them. Motherfucker, let me up. Oh, I can get up here. Hey ah. Now then, time to waste 300 minutes with this. I'll just spin move. You guys... You guys just do your thing. Ah, yeah. Oh no, there's more. I'll just keep spinning. You guys do your thing. Oh shit, there's a ranger over here. How did he get over here? <laughs> he was also lying in wait for, for us. I can picture it now. He's just hiding there behind us. Like, uh, uh, we're, we're all sitting there like, ah, yes, we're gonna stay here and we're gonna hide from these guys. And then you got this big giant amal. You're like, oh yeah, so I'm gonna wait here and I'm gonna hide from these guys. <laughs> We're all just sitting behind a giant or a fucking wall, staring, staring out. Nobody, none the wiser. Yay, now we're getting captured. Wow, thank you. The Bowl of Emperors is now accessible. Yes, it is. Hello, Flame Private. Yes, I know. I will leave the area, and then we will ready up for our uh, eventual dive. Nope. Trial. Bowl of Embers to face Ifrit. So this one might also take a couple minutes. Aya! Ow! My legs! My legs! I believe I have to be over here anyway. So. Yeah. That's how cool guys sit. All right, so while we're waiting, um, chat, I actually have no idea what to do. Um, I don't know. My phone's currently charging, so we can't do anything with that. Uh, uh, what else is there to do currently? Oh, besides sit here and do absolutely nothing. Uh, I guess if I really wanted to... No, because then I'd have to come back over here, and that's a wasted gill. Like, that's why I want to wait until I have 20k, because then I can look at, um, again, getting some boots and a ring. 
because then it'll be a lot easier for me to do that. So I have to head back to Ulda at some point. And instead of wasting the money to go there, uh, buy the things I want, come back, because I don't know how much the shit's going to be. Um, I'd rather just stay here. Um, other than that, I'm excited to to be to try out some of these new classes that they've got coming out. The uh, female Hrothgar, that's interesting. I don't think I'll ever play it, but whatever. Um, and then there's the uh, painter, the... Oh, I forget what the um, dual-wielding uh, swordsman is. Um, I think that's another tank, which if it is, that'd be nice. Add to my tank repertoire. <laughs> Besides, we have like three of... Or uh, uh, four tank classes, four... Um, um, healer classes and like 12 or 13 fucking um uh what are they um dps classes and it's it's a little it's a little one-sided if you ask me but at the same time it's like you, you can do more with dps classes than you can um uh uh god damn it why is my brain fucking up right now you can do more with DPS than you can like tanks or healers because a after some at some point you just kind of reiterate the same stuff over and over again. Like for uh um for astrologian that's an interesting one. Um for sage that's an interesting one. Uh I think astrologian is also the one with the cards. I don't I don't remember. Soul shall birth for eternity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut your fucking mouth, Ifrit. Come here. Let's go. Get your ass back here so we can duke it out like two fellow men. Mano Imano. Man to man. Oh, shit. Whoops. Hey, we got him. <laughs> Look at that. That was quick. Hold on, nobody leave. Ah, damn it. I could give it to this guy. I wish I, I wish I didn't only have one commendation I had to give people. I wish I had three. I want to give it to everybody. Y'all are great. Yeah, see, I knew I'd be back here. All right, time to report to the Waking Sands. There's a lot going on over here today. That's why. <laughs> Level 58. <laughs> Normally when I see really nicely dressed people, I'm like, um, you are level 90 or some shit, because that's usually what I associate with. Or their recruiter for their, uh, uh, for their respective, uh, FC free companies. Oh, did I just get a ring? Hold on. This might be what I'm looking for. Please, for the love of God, do not replace the Uldan ring. I like that one. Place the other one. Yay. Wait. Oh, that's a fucking wristband. God damn it. <laughs> I guess I don't know what I'm wearing anymore. But well... Oh, baby, here we go. Time to choose a, a grand company. I think we're nearing the halfway point. 
No. I think Titan's the halfway point. Once we beat Titan, then I think we're halfway done with uh, A Realm Reborn, which is perfectly fine. Pending the one over here. New Gridania. 531 gil! What a waste. One moment, chat. So that way, don't get under the chair. Sorry, the tortoise is out. The Aethernet to go to the Miketos Amphitheater. Damn, I literally need five more accommodations in order to get the life of the party thing. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Skip it. I'd rather go to the one in Limsa first because I have to head back to Ulda anyways. To the stateroom. Yes, please. I would like to. Skip it. <clears throat> and then we head to Ulda. Do the last ceremony. Maybe if this game decides it wants to load fast enough. There we go. Panel and steps of. No. Shit. Help. Oh, what the fuck? I. Good lord. <laughs> Yes, there we go. Okay. Going back to, uh, to Ulda. <laughs> the steps have nulled. And I already know which grand company we're joining. We're joining the, uh, um, the Limpsons. The Limpsons. I just, I don't know, I... Uh... I like the salute. I'm just there for the salute. I like the, the regular salute. I was in the military. Of course I like the salute. But I... Mm, who do we really want to go with? Like, as much as I really like the Lumens in salute... I don't know. The gear for all of them kind of looks like meh. At least the gear for Limsa Lominsa, or the... um. Why am I not able to remember their fucking... The Maelstrom. That's what it is. 
The gear that the Maelstrom have, it at least fits the color scheme that I'm going with, the red and black. Um, meanwhile, you have the uh, dark green and orange and yellows of everybody else, and I'm just like, I really prefer not to, <laughs> if I could. If I have the choice in the matter, I prefer red and black. It's the ultimate color scheme. It's the color scheme of our channel, for fuck's sake. Red and black. Portsman Philia at the Waking Sands. Of course, I will be there momentarily. to the solar. Hello. Yes, I have. They're all pretty cool. I just like the color scheme of the Maelstrom. What the fuck is happening here? Yes, I get it. Those two are talking about how pain and suffering still exists and how it's really upsetting and very, very sad. Hello, Storm Officer. I would like to join the Maelstrom, please and thank you. Yes, we are joining the Maelstrom. Yeah. Join the Maelstrom because of the colors. <laughs> Stay for the Rogues Guild. Rogues. Is there nothing interesting over there for you, bud? I can't wait till I get my own place. I'll definitely have to figure out how to set up a tortoise cam. So that way, uh, if you guys want it, I can definitely do that. Otherwise, right now, it, it's a pain in the ass because, like, I gotta find him first. Hope he's not asleep. And then, if he is, I can't pick him up. And then, I, it's, it's a pain. It's a pain. That's all I can say. But, if we get our own place, it means we can figure that shit out. Oh, he's all the way down there. Got you. He's currently running around my room like a maniac. So close to being level 30. Come on. Why? Why does that take so long? I believe you are expecting me, sir. Doug. Uh, at least I can quick teleport to to lower Linosia. Uh, to lower Linosia to Tempest Gate. And if you'll excuse me, chat, I'm going to have something to eat real quick because I'm hungry. BRB. Well, I'm sorry, not BRB. I'm just gonna mute up and have a couple 
granola bars real quick. Hungry. I just need a quick snack. 